And who could forget this video? A wild chase on live TV that covered the metro area last year. I remember the fear sitting here in the studio as we watched this chase live on air, not knowing how it would end. It started when the man behind the wheel stole a car with a four-year-old child inside. Then he carjacked two more drivers. You can see one right here. Even hit a state patrol trooper. Well, today a judge sentences the person responsible. Number 7 reporter Lindsay Watts joins us live from Castle Rock now. Lindsay. Dale, the man driving that day is named Ryan Stone. He's 30 years old, and he will likely get a life sentence today, being that he is looking at 64 to 100 years behind bars, and it could be even more than that, being that he was found to be a habitual offender. What was so memorable about this case is that Air Tracker 7 was overhead for the entire chase. So we were watching all of this happen live. It started in Longmont when Stone stole a red minivan with a four year old inside. Then he ditched that car, he carjacked two more drivers. He put hundreds of people at risk uh, that day. It was back in March of 2014. Stone drove the wrong way down major roads at speeds topping 100 miles an hour. Then when a state trooper tried to put down stop sticks, Stone hit and seriously injured him. All this because he was wanted for drug charges and was trying to get away. And at trial, we found out that he was high on meth, marijuana, and an anxiety drug at the time. The only person who was seriously hurt was that state trooper. His name is Bellum and He, and he has never spoken publicly about what happened. We do expect to hear from him today after this sentencing here, which happens at 8:30. We are live in Castle Rock. Lindsay Watts, Denver 7.